A promise first made decades ago staying strong this holiday season. Friends and loved ones taking part in an annual tradition that has spread throughout the Harlingen community. CBS 4's Patrick Chalvier has a story. Leonila Alvarez has always been a religious person, but her faith was elevated by her husband's aunt. Ella transmitió esa fe a mí. Yo tenía fe, pero ella me dio más fuerza a mí. As Genoviva Alvarez's loved ones were off protecting their country during World War II, she made a promise for their safe return. Si venían con vida sus hermanos, que no vinieran en un cajón, mis, una casquet, entonces ella tendrían una fiesta para él cada 24 de diciembre, que es Christmas Eve. Her wishes came true and so began the celebrations. Years passed and the tradition remained, a tradition that struck a chord for Leonila. Pues yo me encanté con la tradición porque dije yo, ay, mira nomás lo que tiene esta gente aquí. Leonila's own family began to grow and though she wasn't able to spend as much time as she did with her husband's aunt, the family wanted to continue in the tradition. So before passing away, Leonila's husband converted a room in their home to something special, a shrine that, after his death, has become a staple in their home. Para mí significa mucho, mucho, mucho. Now, years later, Leonila makes it her duty to keep the shrine up, a beacon for those to not only pray at, but to ask for prayers when the going gets tough. The shrine includes figurines both biblical and symbolic. We have a river to symbolize the river of life, river of hope. We have firemen in the family. The shrine's notoriety has grown so big that women looking for love have even left behind their own mementos, only to have their prayers answered. And they ask the baby, not the baby, the miracle that will happen if we believe. And they got married. The following year, they come and bring something. I, I, have, I brought this because I asked for a house and I kept my house. This Christmas Eve, as others before, family members join together to sing, pray, and even ask for forgiveness. Leonila says what began as an idea flourished into something she could have never imagined. Yo pues nomás era el rosario y cantábamos y comíamos, pero todo es por devoción, de, de, la devoción que tenemos a nuestro Señor. In Harlingen, Patrick Chalvier, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.